Okay, well, let's see if we can actually get anybody into this. Because that would be, actually be nice. We're monitoring you from here. I like the juxtaposition of him wearing the ornate stuff, and I'm over here just unworthy. <laughs> it's funny to me. Oh, it's funny that he has Throggy, or uh, Throggy as well. Or uh, Kamala. That's that's funny. So there's technically three Thors. <laughs> the message originated from that was terrible. Forest. Records show there's a decommissioned aim base here. Just the building. Remain. That's not aim protocol. They usually strip it clean. The mystery deepens. Oh no, the mystery deepens, you guys. Why do I see him? The, the what? Never left this place. I'm not so sure. This doesn't feel like their MO. Either way, let's get to where that call came from. I don't think these Woken can be reasoned with, sir. Oh, that's All cool, game. Is not what is that? Twisted Mongols dedicated to me and... Okay, let's check it out. Carefully. Trying to get over there, but uh, the game kind of fucked me. Looks like it. Jarvis? I'll scan the monument and get on. Why did he give me his costume? I don't like this one. I want my fucking. There we go. There we go. One more time. Okay, I see. It has to be under a minute. The monument also appears to be a signal transmitter. Which is why we read it at the source of the call. Indeed. It's linked to a nearby structure that just started emitting strange energy readings. Then our mission is clear. Truly our imposter is... I, just so you guys know, I have never done one of these nearby. missions before. I don't really care about time trial stuff, so... This was kind of a surprise whenever they announced this stuff. I should do more of these, honestly. This is actually kind of interesting. This isn't as bad as I thought it was. Time trial stuff never has appealed to me. I definitely understand the appeal to some people, but I just, it's not for me. Strange power readings are growing stronger, which is probably a bad thing. Roger that. Okay. 
another trap. Destroying the nearby transformers should bypass the security systems and allow us access. Ouchies. There it goes. That just, that was annoying. Can I get a revive? Got, if I'd gotten actually revived, I could have gotten and just ran and done that. That's fine. Yeah, I don't like the fact that you're constantly losing health. That's not fun. Let's check it out. Okay. Structure is sealed, as I should be able to bypass the main door control. Yes, either they're part of AIM or some kind of radical option. There's the entrance. Another trap. Destroying the nearby transformers should bypass the security system and allow us access. Jesus. God, the damage my weapon becomes when it goes blunder mode. It's so much fun. I got it, I got it. There's one. Where's the last guy? Oh, there he is. That wasn't the last guy! There's three doors right now, guys. Let your lie be exposed. Welcome, interlopers. Uh, Thor, this is pretty weird. And annoying. Face me in battle, deceiver. We shall see who is worthy of the name Thor. Oh, my worship. 
worshippers' faith is not in question. Woken, hear me! The false god comes! Destroy him! <laughs> that was fast. <laughs> He's fucking glitching the shit out. I love it. Oh, it's not that hard of a mission to do, at least. Nice work. We'll analyze. Ooh. I can't tell you how valuable this data is to us. I actually got an epic. Oh, hell yeah. Let's fucking do that. Okay, so this is me in editing. Basically, uh, I didn't know this, but it didn't record the other guy's voice. And so you'd only hear my side of the conversation, and I don't think that'd be all that fun. But essentially, uh, at the beginning of this, I ask him what his experience was with the game's uh, event going on right now. And he said it wasn't that great. No one wanted to do duplicate characters. And that no one was talking. So he had the, a similar experience to me. Which I'm kind of disappointed about. And it's pretty much how it's going to be for a while until this game picks up in popularity. Which I hope it does, honestly. So I figured I would just sit here and uh, talk over the gameplay that you're going to see. Even though you can't really hear any uh, combat stuff. It doesn't really matter. But yeah, essentially I'm trying to speed through this as fast as I can. And... Because I have to do one more after this one. And... Uh, after this one, that guy, I think he glitches out of the lobby. And I kind of get stuck with a random that's not playing the same character as me, so it doesn't really matter. And I was like, you know what, I'll still finish it, just get the reward and stuff. And then the game glitches and puts me in a black screen when we have to reload the checkpoint. And so I have to boot the whole game out and lose all of that footage. I'm not mad. You're mad. <laughs> so, yeah. It, it wasn't a fun time, honestly. <clears throat> I was kind of disappointed by that. But, honestly, the guy was pretty cool. He's pretty laid back. You'll see how funny it is when you have three Thors hitting a uh, fucking... Uh, what is it? Adaptoid with all of his fucking supers at one, back to back to back. It's kind of ridiculous. The damage output Thor can get is ludicrous, to say the least. I wish, uh, I don't know, I, I kind of can't wait for them to be able to add multiple heroics. Like, I want them to give us the ability, as time goes on, to swap heroics around. Like, instead of having Thor's ultimate being the Bifrost, he just, uh, basically activates the ability to uh, just send out a massive shockwave of lightning and electricity 
stump something like that. Or uh, like hit, instead of the current assault heroic he has, where he lifts everyone up and hits them with lightning. He kind of pulls a Captain America and just flings the uh, hammer and it homes in on like multiple people and takes them out. Stuff like that. I think that'd be pretty cool. But yeah, pretty much uh, I realized that they were going to go and get a couple of items. So I decided to follow them because uh, me going there by myself would have been suicide. Would not have been a fun time, I got to say, boss. Yeah. Sorry about this. It's I'm very upset that the game didn't record his audio or that I couldn't record his uh, voice cuz it kind of makes this not as fun. But oh well. I also gave him a heads up that he was going to be in a video and he was cool with that, so Oh, like if I'm going to have someone's voice in the in my videos, I I make sure they know ahead of time. And doesn't really matter at this point, but yeah, I was going to give him the disclaimer anyway. So from this point on, I'll just uh, fast forward until the end of the mission where we fight the Adaptoid. And then I will get back to you in the video. And we have one more mission to go through, and it's kind of disappointing. Yeah, the, uh, apparently there was a apparently there was a glitch on Xbox that caused the uh, b uh, for them to appear on the character models. Yeah. Well, this guy is uh, completely dead. <laughs> Just three different Bifrost come down. <laughs> oh, it's funny. So, a similar thing happened in this mission where no one wanted to talk. So, instead of putting you all through dead silence, I'm just going to speed up to the final mini-boss fight against the Adaptoid. So, you can see how quickly we wiped him, just to show again how stupid damage works in this game. And, uh, play a little fun song for y'all. And I got a double whammy question for you. What game is this song from? And two, what song is this a direct ripoff of? I hope you all enjoyed the video, and I will see you guys in the next one. Later.